Hello, I'm Tesla. In this tutorial for the Unreal Engine 4, we're going to make objects or characters look at each other. So for example, we can make a character constantly look at another character while he moves around. So this is a nice easy one, and let's jump right in. Okay, so for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm just going to use this My Character Blueprint. I'm going to drag him out, and we're going to make this guy constantly look at our player. So to do this, we're going to come into Level Blueprint. We're going to zoom in a bit, and we're going to right click and we're going to type in find look at rotation so with this we have an output which outputs a rotation value and we have a start and target vector input so with the start it's going to be this guy we've selected so we're going to add a reference to him we're going to drag him out we're going to type in get actor location and we can connect those vectors up now and the target so we want to make this guy look at the target. The target is going to be our player. So we're going to right click, we're going to type in get player character. We're going to drag this out and we're going to type in get actor location again and connect the target up. And with the rotation output, we'll drag this out and we're simply going to type in set actor rotation. And we have a target. The target is going to be this guy because he's the one that's going to have his rotation updated so let's say we press G and he'll look at us so he's not looking at us now I press G and he begins to look at us we can make him constantly look at us by just using an event tick However, we have a problem. He's constantly looking at us, which is fine, but when we jump over him, or say we go below him, ooh, he starts flying. So to get rid of that, we need to filter out some of the rotation values. So we're going to come into the level blueprint again, and we're going to let's move this over here. We're going to drag this out, and we're going to break rot. And now with the yaw, we're going to drag that out, and we're going to make rot. Now that's going to the pitch, so we want it to go to your... We'll just break that link there. And with the output, we can connect that up there now. So what we're doing is just filtering out those values, which we don't want. So it's going to stop him from just flying, basically, and looking up at us. Like so. So one last scenario we can do, we can just set up a simple box trigger. Scale that up. We'll come into level blueprint, we'll grab this tick, we'll move it up here, we'll drag it out, we're going to type in gate, and we're going to right click now, we're going to add event, collision, begin overlap, add event, collision, end overlap, connect the begin overlap to open, and the end overlap to close. Okay. So when we enter this box trigger, he's going to look at us, and when we, when we exit, he's going to stop looking at us. Just like so. Okay guys, that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for checking it out, and make sure you stay subscribed for any of my future tutorials. Cheers guys.